success. Open the gate. Mr. E and the others are back. Sons of Garmadon, we have the first Oni mask. Yes, well done, Mr. E. And not just that, our attack against the ninjas was successful. Ha ha ha. Yes, Sensei Garmadon is no more. But that wasn't the only loss the ninjas took. Moro's been trapped in the Soul Scepter. Good. We're getting close to resurrecting Lord Garmadon. Good indeed. But we still need the last two masks. They'll soon be ours. We might not know where the Mask of Hatred is, but we know the Mask of Deception is being protected at the Royal Palace. Sounds like it's time for us to attack the Royal Palace. This won't be easy, Kilo, but we do need all three masks. Sounds like you could use some extra help. What the? It's the Water Ninja. How dare you compare me to her? Unlike my twin sister, Nia, I am evil! If you are truly evil, then prove it. I don't trust her. This is obviously a trap. It's clearly Nia in disguise. Never compare me to her! Yeah! Not bees! Ah! I wouldn't want to be you right now. <laughs> oh, I like her. Only someone despicable throws bees. Welcome to the Sons of Garmadon. on the mission at hand. The attack on the palace shall begin. Sons of Garmadon, time to ride. You heard Ultraviolet? Let's go. The mask of deception will be ours. Keep off, evil Nia. <laughs> Don't worry. I can keep up. Let's get that Oni mask. I still can't believe it. My father is gone. I'm sorry for what happened, Lloyd. We'll find a way to avenge him. I know, Jay. I just miss him. That's all. We must focus on stopping the sons of Garmadon. They can't be allowed to get three Oni masks. Zorin's right. But what are these Oni masks anyway? If Sensei was here, he'd be able to tell us all about them. Whatever they are, they're powerful. It gave Mr. E an extra pair of arms. And with all three, they can bring back the evil Lord Garmadon. These guys have to be stopped. This can't be good. The scanners are detecting someone approaching the cave. The sons of Garmadon must be back. Haven't they done enough damage? Do not worry, ninjas. I come in peace. Then what are you doing here? My name is Hutchins, and I am here on behalf of the exalted Jade Princess. She is requesting your immediate assistance. Jade Princess needs our help? What's happened? The sons of Garmadon have stolen the first Oni mask from the royal vault. We know about the sons of Garmadon. They attacked us and slayed Sensei Garmadon. Then you know the threat they pose. The second mask is in the royal palace, and we need your help protecting it. We can't let the second mask fall into their hands. We would be honored to help protect it. Excellent. It's a long journey to the palace, so we must get going. Come on, ninjas. Let's get moving. We're right behind you. You heard, Lloyd. Let's move. Welcome, ninjas, to the royal palace. Whew. We're finally here. That was a really long journey. That's an impressive palace, but does it look a bit spooky to anyone else? Kai's right. It does look ominous. As with most places in Ninjago, here too has a dark history. The palace used to be known as the Temple of Resurrection. The Overlord would perform dark rituals here to resurrect his fallen generals. Okay, that's really creepy. That's enough history for now. The princess is awaiting us inside. 
so keep up. Everyone, let's go. We have a princess to meet. All right, let's just all go into the creepy temple. It brings me great honor to introduce you to the Jade Princess, Princess Harumi. She's, she's beautiful. You must be the ninjas of Ninjago. I have heard so much about all of you. It's an honor to meet you, Princess Harumi. No, the honor is mine. You've all done so much for this land and its people. We're all just doing our part. It's the duty of a ninja to fight back against evil. Indeed it is. But now we face a new threat, the sons of Garmadon. I heard what they did to your father. I'm terribly sorry for your loss. Thank you. I miss him dearly. I lost my parents too, Lloyd. Thankfully, I was adopted by the Emperor and Empress. They're away at the moment on a diplomatic mission. Therefore, I must handle this situation. Well, we're here to help. Hutchins told us you had an only mask that needed protecting. Yes, the mask of deception. Follow me and I'll show you. You guys wait here. I'll check out the mask. Looks like Lloyd has a crush on the princess. Holy moly, Jay. I think you're right. Here it is, the only mask of deception. Whoa, that sure is one demonic mask. Yes, it is. The only mask of relics from the first realm. The realm of the dragon and the Oni. Well, that would explain the supernatural powers they carry. The Lord of the Oni created three masks. He imbued them with the power of vengeance, deception, and hate. Ha, huh, you're really smart for a princess. Oh, uh, uh, thanks. And you're really cute. Uh, you know, for a ninja. Princess Rumi, we have trouble. The sons of Garmadon are coming. No, we can't let them take the mask. Lloyd... You and the others must help defend the palace. Of course, Princess Harumi. Ninjas, with a battle to win. Good luck, Lloyd Garmadon. Leave our team, we have a palace to defend. Gah, it's the sons of Garmadon, not these guys again. The mask will be ours. Sons of Garmadon, begin the attack. If you want the mask, then you'll have to get through us. You can't possibly hope to stop us. That's where you're wrong. We'll easily stop you. And you feel to never get the only mask. Time to crush some bikers. It won't be easy, but we must prevail. Come on, Nia. We've a battle to win. These silly bikers are bound to fail. Soldiers, defend the palace. Yes, Master Hodgson, the battle will be ours. Let's cause some carnage. Ha ha ha. And so it begins. Yeah! What the? <laughs> These guys are going down. Ah! <laughs> Looks like it's my turn to have some fun. You won't be having any fun. Instead, you're in for shock. Yeah! This is going to hurt. Ah! Time to bring the pain. <laughs> Dance strong, men. <laughs> we can't lose. Fire. Not my bait. <laughs> Looks like I'll have to end the ninjas myself. You'll never end us. Whoa. Just you try and stop me. Let's duel. Not good. <laughs> I will do whatever it takes to defend the mask. Then you will perish trying. Let us battle. Yeah! 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 Ah! You fought well, but not well enough. That's it, Mr. E. I won't let you hurt anyone else. Leave her to me. No way! It can't be! Hello, sister. Long time no see. Hey, Ronia, you only ever bring trouble, so you're going down. Once more we shall fight, sister. Let's do this. Yeah. Yeah. Ha. Yeah. Ha. Good to know I'm still a better fighter. I will put an end to their threat. I'll 
smack you, robot samurai. This is bad. Yeah! Ha ha! I crushed her. The only mask is nearly ours. We'll never let you take it, Mr. Eager. Using the power of the mask of vengeance, I shall obliterate you. Ah! Oh no! Ah!
now, the U.S. strategy of restraint had backfired. The South was on the receiving end, with nothing to defend itself against the communist tanks and heavy artillery. In just two days, Seoul, the South Korean capital lying 30 miles below the parallel, was captured by the North. Terrified South Koreans rushed to escape the city. Roads leading south over the Han River were jammed with refugees and truckloads of equipment. But in fear of the communist advance, southern officials ordered the bridges destroyed. When they exploded, hundreds of refugees were still struggling to cross. Nearly all of them perished. Thousands more were cut off from escape. saw two opposing superpowers emerging in the form of the United States of America and the Soviet Union. The United States was capitalist, a system where almost everything is privately owned and run for profit. The Soviet Union was communist, a system where everyone owns the means to create a common wealth, all based around a central ideology. After dealing with Nazi Germany, these two superpowers sought to spread their influence throughout the world, and thus the Cold War began. The Cold War wasn't a direct war, but a series of proxy wars and decades of intimidation, propaganda and espionage. Germany was occupied after the war. The Soviets controlled the area around Berlin, but not all the city itself. There were already tensions between the Soviet Union and the Western Allies as they felt threatened by each other and feared for a new war. British Prime Minister Winston Churchill declared that an iron curtain had descended across Europe. Soviet leader Joseph Stalin didn't like the idea of West Germany regaining any former power, so in 1948 the Soviets blockaded the western sections of Berlin to force the other allies to give them control of the whole city. It didn't work as the western allies airlifted supplies in. In 1949, NATO was formed to strengthen the western allies. Germany became divided into east and west, as was Berlin itself. Stalin wanted to be in control of the country's on Russia's borders to ensure security.